Hello everyone, thank you for taking a look at my video and my channel, and welcome to Grand Union. Guys, today is day number five for the wedding event. Uh, it is Sunday, uh, June 5th, and we are going to go over to Harv's Island and take some photos for Reese and Cyrus. You ready to go? So guys, I have to say, this is kind of fun. This is the first time, like, in my video creating history here on YouTube that I've actually done multiple days and, like, multiple, um, like, day number one, day number two, day number three. Um, I've always seen other creators do, like, like, series um, where they're playing the game and each day is, like, a new day to to count, and uh, it's, it's kind of fun, I have to say. It's, I'm really kind of, uh, I don't know, I'm not surprised, but uh, I didn't think playing Animal Crossing I would actually ever be doing um, consecutive days in a row, because uh, usually events are just a one-day thing, so, but the wedding event is kind of a little bit different. It's like, like, it's like a month-long event. Um, I think we're coming down to the end of it, though. I think after day number seven, um, I think the prizes or the um, items that are crafted um, are just repeats, um, but you have options as far as, um, what is it, the, uh, the variances that you can get. All right, I want to fly. So just to get the paperwork all official, where'd you want to go? I want to go to Harv's Island. Roger that, good buddy. All right, guys, let's get rocking and rolling here. Time to take off. So I hope everyone's had a great weekend. Um, it's been pretty uneventful here. I've been working, but um, when I get home, I usually like to try to record a video real quick um, to get it ready for you guys so you can take a look at it. And um, for everybody watching the video, guys, thank you so much for uh, watching. Um, I really appreciate it. It actually motivates me to um, get on and play my game and um, just kind of hit the record button and kind of share with you guys. Um, I have a really great community out there, and um, I just want to say thank you. So it means a lot to me. And I hope you guys are enjoying my uh, video content. So... Guys, it's Harv. He's playing his tambourine, guys. Check it out. Oh, yeah. All right, guys. Let's go in. Hey, it's Chuck. Good to see you. So, uh, gonna do more anniversary photos with Reese and Cyrus? Or do you got a question about the studio? Anniversary photo time. Right on. Give me half a sec to get my kitsch, I mean my wedding set ready. Hold tight. All right. We're holding tight. Oh, guys, look at the balls. Okay, so seriously, this wallpaper reminds me something from the 70s. All right, story time. I had looked at a apartment condominium back in, oh gosh, I was just, it was a few years ago now. Um, but the property was built back in the late 60s. It was like a concrete high-rise building, and it was a really cute unit, and um it was, it was an older unit. It had kind of a lot of the original features. But one of the things that was the craziest was that when you walked in the front door, there was a half bath. And when you opened that door, it was wallpapered from floor to ceiling. And it was like this kind of grayish color. But whatever the pattern was, I can't even remember the pattern, but... All I can remember was that it was like 
almost like this iridescent, shiny, almost like metal. Kind of like, see the stars on the wallpaper? It, it literally kind of looked like that. That's so funny seeing that. It's like, it brings me back to that bathroom. It was, it was pretty intense, guys. All right, enough story time. Let's see what Reese needs from us today. Oh, thanks so much for coming back to work with us on another set of photos, Chuck. I can't wait to see how these ones turn out. So today I'm thinking we should take a ceremony photo in a place that looks like a wedding chapel. It'll be just like our real ceremony, profession, professing our love for each other in front of everyone. So romantic. Oh, and by the way, my handy dandy Psy guy made some new furniture. Isn't he the best? Anyway, now you have even more to work with. Just take a look at the event tab. I can't wait to see what you come up with. What we're looking for is a cute set with plenty of pink and white. Preferably using lots of the furniture my Psy guy made. When you're all done with the set and we've got a few photos in the can, come talk to me, okay? Thanks. All right, guys. So they're looking for pink and white and cute, and it's an <coughs> another ceremony day. So let's see what we got here, guys. Oh, so it's the cloud floor. Um. All right, we're gonna do the white wedding wall. We're gonna do the white wedding flooring. Ooh. Guys, we have a new item. Guys, we got the wedding pipe organ. Oh goodness gracious, it's huge. Okay, all right, all right. We got ourselves a big music box. All right. All right, now guys, remember, not too much. We don't want to get crazy. This is the last time we had like a big fire violation. Okay, we're just gonna start with that. Let's start with that, guys. All right. I'm gonna put that over there. How's that look? Oh, that looks good, right? I don't want to have it in the back. I kind of want it up front here. All right, and then we're going to put... Um, I don't know. What if, guys, what if, what if, how about if I put these little flower ball things down on this side this time? Does that make sense? How does it look? Oh yeah, that doesn't look bad. All right. All right. Hmm. All right. I'm gonna push that back one. So it's in line with the window. All right, that looks good. So is everybody having a good time with the wedding event? I guess apparently you do ceremony photos and then you do um, reception photos 
like every other day for the first, I guess, kind of week. And I guess we have like a garden party coming up pretty soon. Oh, this actually looks really nice. I really like those over there like that. that lined up too well, do I? Alright, so we got that there like that. And we got that there. Oh, this is coming together pretty quick, guys. I like that. Alright, next we need two more. Two more. Whoops. Yeah. Put this one down here in front of the window. And guys, I appreciate all your comments that you've been leaving for me on the uh, videos. I hope you guys are enjoying. Um, I don't usually be, I don't usually put out this much content. I usually only do like try to do like two videos a week, just so that. You're not inundated with trying to watch everything that I put out. Because I know everybody has busy lives. So, um, but I appreciate everybody that has been viewing the videos. Alright, so we got one there. We're not putting that on the window. Alright. So let's put that there like... Like that. That in there like that. Put this one over here like. Like that. I don't know. Not many options here, guys. Alright, come on. I'm gonna put it next to the window because there it's close to the windows. Like it's tucked right in on either side of the window. So I don't want to come over here and then have it tucked over by the doors. I'll keep it by the windows. Alright guys, here we go. Whoops. Ooh, dark. Alright. One, two, three. And I know I want a couple for up front. So that one looks good like that. That one looks good there. This one's going to come over here like this. Alright, like that, like that. Alright, last but not least. Uh-oh, what did we do? What did I do? I don't want to do that. Oh, there we go. Alright, guys. There we go. So what else am I what else am I missing guys? I'm missing something. Uh, let's go back in here. So that's the wedding head table. Do I want to put one of those in here? That's more for like the reception, isn't it? Oh, look, we can actually change the... I knew this was going to be coming up. You actually have the option where you can change going for the cute white and pink. Then we have the chic, which is kind of white and gold. And then we have the garden, which is white and green. The garden set actually is really cool. All right, so what I was thinking... Thinking, thinking, guys. What if I put... Yeah, like a set of candles on top of the table. All right. All right, let's hope and pray that the flower sconce doesn't catch on fire from the candles. 
I don't have any control over that. All right. Well, at least if we're going to have a fire this time, we're not going to be blocked in by tables and chairs like we were for the last reception. That was pretty dangerous, honestly. All right. Move you over here. What else do I need, guys? I got the I got the organ. I know the head table really is not not supposed to be there, but okay, I'm not doing the wedding cake. The wedding chair. Whoops, that wasn't what I wanted to do. Hey, what are you doing? All right. Thank you. All right. All right, I'm gonna do that just, I'm gonna do that just so that I'm using like extra pieces of furniture. So we got two, four, six, seven, eight, nine pieces of furniture. And then I don't know if the little, what are these called again? The little wedding flower stand. So I don't know if that necessarily counts as furniture. Like I know the chair, the bench, the head table, the wedding table, event table. I know that all counts, but I don't know about like the candle set, the cake, I know the pipe organ would count as furniture. But you have to use a certain amount of furniture in the room. Like if you show up and you just have like one sconce, flower sconce on the wall, you have like one or two benches and then one or two of the flower stands, you're not gonna get all the heart crystals. So, I don't know guys, I think this looks really good. This came together pretty quick. All right. Once everything is ready, would you mind being our photographer again? You did such a nice job before. Just press ZL to open the camera app within the studio and then press the plus button to take a photo, remember? Thanks again for all your hard work. I can't wait to see how these are going to turn out. All right. ZL. And I'm going to hit the minus button because I want to put it in. I really like this feature, guys. This is a great 2.0 feature, isn't it? All right, get them to get them to look. All right, they're looking, guys, and they got the candles in the background. Should I zoom in a little bit? That looks, that's too close. Yeah, that looks nice like that. All right. And then let's do the ZL and see what we can do for, I don't want it to be sharp. That's kind of cute. It's called pop. All right, let's take a photo of that. Everybody's looking, nobody's blinking. All right, that works. And then we got the soft, the dramatic. Ooh, guys, the dramatic's really nice. Look at the ro look at the roses, guys. And you can see the candles. The candles are lit in the back. All right. Let's take a picture of that. And we got the film. I don't really like that. Monochrome. <laughs> Cyrus looks like a ghost. Antique. You can't even see Cyrus. He blends him with the wall. Well, the painting's kind of cool, too, guys. All right, let's do the painting. We got the retro, the surveillance camera, 
the fish eye. I don't know, I think that they would not be happy if I did this as their wedding photo. What do you think, guys? I know I'd be very upset. All right, I think that's good. So let's see. Um, whoops. No, no, we'll do that. Oh. to the album. So this was the painting, the dramatic, and then the pop. All right, guys, which is your favorite? So this is the pop finish. This is the dramatic finish, which I really kind of like how the flowers kind of stand out they have really good definition and then this is the painting so everything is very soft and subtle that's different all right let's beat it back out of this let's go back into play mode all right guys Oh, that last one seemed nice. Mind if I take a quick peek? The painting one? Absolutely. Did you take more than one? I'll just look at the last one if you, that's okay. Sure, go ahead. All right, guys, so you'll have to let me know if you think the pop, the dramatic, or the painting one, which one you thought was the best. So leave a comment below because uh, I'd like to hear back what you think. Oh my goodness, it's everything I could have ever wanted. You somehow captured all the joy and love that my darling and I share in one amazing photo. I love it. Anyway, I have a little something to show our appreciation. I hope you like it. My Psy Guy made it just for you. It's a wedding pipe organ. Oh guys, we're getting a pipe organ? That's a pretty impressive thank you gift, don't you think? That pipe organ's huge. It's going to be kind of funny to put on the beach, though, don't you think? I'm doing a beach wedding. And because I'm just full of surprises, I also have some heart crystals for you. I think the heart crystals are really pretty. Well, that was so much fun, and we made another great photo. I hope you'll come back tomorrow for another shoot. Howdy, Squirt. Any interest in trading those heart crystals for some of my furniture? Reese thinks they're pretty deal. All right, what's grabbing you? All right, guys, I got the benches. All right, I think I need two more chairs, right? Guys, I'm gonna have to write stuff down on a post-it note <laughs> so I can remember, because now I'm drawing a blank. I know I have the, um, I do wanna get rid of some more heart crystals. Um, so I know I have gotten all four of the benches. I'm just gonna do four. Two, four, six, that'll be eight. And then I was gonna do two tables and then eight chairs. So I got the chairs. And then what did I get the other day? I got the head table as a gift. And then I think I got the wedding cake. Did I get the wedding cake and the candles? I think I probably should get the candles. Oh, 
Oh my god, 40, 40 crystals? Wow, guys, I got that as a free gift? That's worth 40 heart crystals, guys. And I got it as a thank you present. That's pretty impressive. Alright, I'm not gonna do any of this finish again. Because I'm not going to, um... That's kind of cool. I'm not going to decorate. I'm not going to put this... Well, listen to me. I'm not going to put this in my house. Watch, you'll come in the next day and they'll be like... It'll be all decorated for the wedding season. Maybe in my back room. Like the back room with the orange walls that has all the uh, villager photos that used to live on my island. So, that's kind of like... I call it my time capsule room because I never go in there. And that was like the very first room I decorated. Um... It was like all the stuff that was like in the main house originally and I kind of pushed it into that back room as I was collecting things and kind of arranged it so it looked I guess somewhat nice and made sense and then I never go in that room again so it was like all of a sudden one day when I walked in that room I was like oh my gosh like I haven't been in here forever since like 2020. <laughs> all right um I think I already got the second wedding table. All right, I think I'm just gonna do some of the flower stands today. All right, so I got that. All right, one more, one more, guys. All right, I'm going to do one more wedding flower stand. That'll take all my heart crystals for today. Because those will look nice next to the benches like I did here. So guys, along with commenting um, which picture you liked best, uh, guys, tell me what you think of my decorating job here. Did you guys pretty much just use what was in the event tab? Or did you like take out of your household inventory to put stuff in here too? So, I'll be interested to hear. Well, that's it for now. Of course, we'll be here all month, so we'd love to have you help out. Help again tomorrow. All right. Guys, we're out of here. Oh. And yes, guys, that's where I got my um, thumbnail for the uh, videos that you see. I actually did a screenshot of it. Train wreck race pudding reporting Tango Snooker is go. Do you require assistance? Over. I'm ready to go home. You want to bust some Bunsen burners and bounce back to Cherrytown? Wilbur, I want to go back to Grand Union, please. And yes, I'm ready to go now, so let's pack snacks and make tracks. Alright guys. I really appreciate you uh, sticking around and watching the video today. Look forward to hearing your comments. Um, thank you to everybody that has recently subscribed on my channel. And uh, if you haven't subscribed, uh, consider hitting the subscribe button if you want to check out future videos from me and find out what I'm up to. Um, I've been working on challenging myself this year doing design and redesign of Grand Union. And I'll take a quick peek at my map. You know, sometimes people like to look at that. Um, but I basically have been kind of changing uh, the way the water flows through the island and then the terraforming on the island. And yeah, you can see up in the... Can I do it real quick? You can see in this upper right-hand corner, there's some activity going on over here. That's where the um, garden farm, farmer stand is over there. So we got some pumpkins, we got tomatoes, carrots, potatoes, wheat, and sugarcane. 
and the apple orchards in the right hand corner. So it definitely is uh it's it's coming together. I'm really I'm really excited. Uh the campsite's looking pretty good. Um stay tuned for some more um guess who's at the campsite short videos. They should be coming out um relatively soon. I wanna finish up with the um wedding event. I think there's only gonna be like maybe two more episodes after this. And then um it basically is just gonna be repeating the same thing. Um you just get to change the, um, what do you call it? Instead of using the cute pink and white set, you're going to be using other, the cheek or the garden style. So, but yeah, that's what I've been up to, guys. So, um, definitely consider subscribing. Come and meet my villagers, see what I'm up to. And, um, yeah. All right, guys. Thanks for hanging out for a while today. I hope you enjoyed the video. Hope this made you smile. And uh, thanks for playing the wedding day event with me. I really appreciate it. Until next time, guys, I will talk to you soon. Take care. Are you, are you saying hi, Chuck? No, we're, we're, we're ending the video. We're ending the video now, so you're going to want to say goodbye. All right, guys. Until next time, we'll talk to you soon. Bye. Oh, good job, Chuck. I'm proud of you. We all make mistakes. It happens. I gotta start moving my flowers around. Getting this area fixed up. All right. Looks pretty nice.